What up and welcome. I am Matthew Msingati, the designer and developer from South Africa. I've got an interesting question for you as a designer. What if you could be asked to design a component exactly like this one? Obviously, it's an easy task, but there are two ways to go about it. People who are designers only, they only know the first option, of which it failed for me when I got into the real life environment designing something that will use in production so the first option is to go to figma use your design skill to sample this as it is well it might work perfectly depending on your skill but sometimes there are colors that you have to sample and also there are spaces between elements that must be exactly as they are on top of that there is a constant change and request to change the ui let's just look at other thing we've got theming okay which might also cause some minor changes because the development team might say can you design a darker version of the same button if you apply this method there will be a back and forth process between you and the cto or and the development team about certain things that must be specific well there is another option as Matthew Singati, the designer and also a developer. Let me introduce you to a component library that the developers use, which is called Shared CN. It's like a ready-made template that as developers we use all over the world. Let's just take a look at it. Let's look at the example of a dashboard. As you can see, this is how this will be in production. Meaning that if you are designing this on Figma, you have to get this exactly as is. Because developers, they love it because it makes their life easier. Also, it talks to the development environment, fast pace and lot of changes. So how would you solve this problem if you are aware of this library? Well, let's just go to a documentation. You will go to shared cn documentation and then you will look for this part as you can see there is a part which is figma okay so when you get into this part you will just click this link and then when you click this link you will be presented with a figma file that has got the components ready made for you i think this is the guy who has designed this beautiful template so let's open this on figma as you can see this is the file with everything in it let's just jump to components as you can see guys these are shared cn components on figma this then means if you could be asked to design any shared cn component that will mean you just have to go to this file and look for that component let's just go here and see what we have as you can see guys these are all the components that are available on shared cn let's just look for a radio group then let's press shift 2 to zoom it up as you can see guys this is the component as it is ready made for you the only thing that you can do you can just change the colors and then plug and play why are you going to do that simply because developers they are relying on shared cn so it's very important to get these component exactly as they are this also can save your time as a designer because these components are already available I am Matthew Singati, the designer and developer from South Africa. If you feel like this video has added value, please do me a favor and subscribe. In case you might want to see some of the things in development, as a developer, I've got also another channel where I show everything practically. How do I take a Figma file and translate it to a React equivalent? Simply because I am also a React developer as well. Thank you so much. Don't forget to subscribe.